Just took a little cat nap. Boys are asleep. I'm tired. We're all tired. Family's a little sick. I already mentioned that. We're just kind of struggling. It's a Monday. It's a Monday. I got a case of the Mondays. <laughs> but something just arrived. I don't know what this is. Hold on. I This is not my bag. Congratulations, Seth. Well, I'll be darn. Found a little surprise in the studio shed. Hi, Seth. Just a note to congratulate you on your heroic performance at Run Rabbit Run 2018. Loved the vlogs. Super inspirational to all, whether runners or not. Thanks for your amazing contributions to so many of us reminding of what a life well lived means. God bless you, Bridget and the boys. Love. Oh, that's awesome. You're amazing. It was hard. It was hard. And I love it. And I appreciate that. That's that's amazing. I um, I think I know who this is from. But I'm not going to say. I'm not going to say. Family friend. Family friend. Hold on. Let's see what else is in the bag. <laughs> yes! Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm laughing. I'm laughing. I'm laughing. Yeah. <laughs> Guess what's in the bag? Salt. Bacon. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. If you watched, oh my god, you are amazing. Go watch the race vlog. All of this will make sense. I'm not going to explain it again right now, but all of this, especially, especially this one, this will all make sense. You're amazing. Thank you for listening. Thank you for hearing my my concern for my, my physical health through the food. I might have some right now. You're amazing. Ah. I've learned over time not to start a crazy project late at night, especially when you're tired. You gotta think straight and have good light. Put together a shed. That's what came in the mail today, that big box. It's all part of opening up space in the studio. Ah, we're getting there. At least I got it unloaded. It's kind of, it's got a lot of pieces. Oh boy. Oh boy. Been reading your comments, and thank you from all the Run Rabbit Run vlogs. It was wild, but your comments lift me up through the pain, through the uh, the tiredness, through the, you know, failure of not being able to run 100 miles in, on that day. But uh, we keep fighting, and I was going to read a comment of the week tonight, because it's Monday, but I'm not going to, because the love that showed up at our front door today is just getting my wheels turning, and I jumped into a project for work this evening on my computer, basically transcribing an interview that I did with a gentleman last last spring who is no longer with us and he um, he was you know probably in his 60s or 70s probably in his 70s and you know a very aggressive cancer took his life you know claimed his life and it just got me thinking about his words on friendship and um, the opportunity that we have with people, especially in our immediate surroundings, like our neighbors, you know, um, and that opportunity to interact and have conversations without our phones, not through a text message, and just really entering into that other person's life. And we can do that as best as possible here on YouTube in the comments below. But it is, it is limited, and I am, you know, that's, that is reality that we, I don't think will ever change, and that's, that's, that's okay. But recognizing that there are people, there are friends, there are neighbors, there are hopefully family members whom you can lean on to go into those deeper conversations, and this gentleman whom I'm transcribing his interview is just a, he, he got it, he, he, he got it, he, he understood that reality in his life and how it impacted his life for many many years and he passed away in a good place and 
in a, in a place of peace in his heart, knowing that he lived a great life and he impacted a lot of lives along the way. So anyway, no comment of the week tonight. This turned into an interesting uh, story today. The shed is not put together. Uh, but that's all right. We're just living. We're trying to communicate. We're trying to interact down below as much as possible. So thank you again for everything. For the bacon, for the, for the salt, for the carrot gold butter, and for being 